Hey there everyone, welcome back to another video. Today I've got some relieving news about a young goalie that has been through a lot these past few years. If you're a Florida Panthers fan or just a hockey fan in general, you won't want to miss this one. I'll be diving into the story of Spencer Knight. So without further ado, let's get into it. Spencer Knight, the promising young goalie for the Florida Panthers, suddenly takes a step back from the game, but it wasn't for the reasons you might think. In an interesting interview with the Hockey News' Ken Campbell, Knight opened up about his unexpected leave from the ice. He revealed that he was dealing with obsessive compulsive disorder, also known as OCD, a condition that was affecting his ability to perform at the high level everyone came to expect from him. Now here's the thing, when Knight entered the NHLPA Players Assistance Program, many assumed it was related to issues like drugs or alcohol, but it turns out it was something entirely different. Knight admitted, I was spiraling in a direction I didn't want to be going. His battle with OCD had started during his time at Boston College, where he found himself repeatedly washing his hands. It was a sign that something was off, and he knew he needed help. Well, let's take a quick trip down memory lane. In 2021, Spencer Knight left Boston College to sign with the Florida Panthers, and he didn't waste any time making his presence known. He made his NHL debut that very season, and even pulled off a stunning win against the Lightning in Game 5 of the playoffs. During the 2021-22 season, Knight was sharing the net with Sergei Bobrovsky. However, it was during this time that Knight's battle with OCD started to take a toll on him. He'd appeared to secure the starting role in December, but things took a turn when he gave up three goals in Winnipeg and was pulled from the game by Coach Paul Maurice. Here's where things get interesting. Coach Maurice said it was merely to give Knight some rest, stating that Spencer has had a good run, but fate had different plans. Knight fell ill during a road trip, much like several other members of the Panthers. In his absence, Bobrovsky stepped up and reclaimed the starting spot. In February, Florida decided to send Knight down to Charlotte to get more playing time. However, it was during this period that he entered the assistance program and didn't return to the Panthers, leaving fans wondering what had happened to their rising star. Now, fast forward to July and Spencer Knight had a burning desire to rejoin the team. He even appealed to participate in Florida's development camp, despite having more experience than most camp attendees. Knight's motivation was crystal clear. He wanted to get back into the groove, work on his game, and show his commitment to the sport he loves. Missing out on his team's incredible journey to the Stanley Cup final had left Knight with mixed emotions. He said, One of the feelings you get when something like this happens is that you just let everyone down. I never wanted to feel like a burden. As the dust settles, Knight is out of the assistance program and ready to hit the ice for training camp. The question on everyone's mind is where he stands with the team. With Bobrovsky as the presumed starter and the addition of free agent Anthony Stolarz, Knight's path is uncertain, but in his own words, I have to be cool with whatever happens. He's embracing the uncertainty and is determined to become not only a better goalie, but also a better person through this journey. And there you have it. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more hockey content, and ring that notification bell so you never miss an update. Until next time, I'm behind the boards, peace!